an overflow idea about what things around us, how could we live on this earth, by know some knowledge about the earthly planets and the other planets in our solar system. You know, uh, this is, I think you have to take some idea about this before. Who, who could describe this? What is this? What do you think about this? This thing, what is this? Yes, it's, 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 it's it represents the sun. The sun, yes, it's okay. What is this? The earth. The earth, it's okay. So, could you, could you remark the differences between all of each of them about the volume? Which one is big? The sun, yes. Which one is, is quite small? Yes? Uh, uh. The earth, yes. What is this one? Yes. This is a moon, yes. So, where we are living? Here or here? Yes. We are living on the earth, yes. It's okay. So, is there any, any planets like, like, like this earth or not? What do you think about this? Yes. Yes. There is another planets like Jupiter, Venus, Mercury. Today we are uh, going to take some uh, knowledge about these planets in our PowerPoint, in our presentation. We will talk, we will take some activities for this uh, uh, topic. So uh, I'd like uh, you to enjoy our lesson today. At the beginning we know, uh, we will show some, uh, some photos in this, uh, this PowerPoint, just to know about our solar system as a system in, the, in our universe. <coughs> As you know, this is our uh, view and scales in this earth. So this is, uh, if, if you are going to see yourself inside the earth itself, how could, how big are you? If you think this is, this is the sun, just a symbol of sun, it's not real sun. So, yes, would you like to see something? It's a tiny pin for it. Yes, yeah, right. So now, now we will see uh, the other of planets and the, the big. This is whole of solar system. We have to know some things about this. This one is, is um, the sun, the huge one. It's very really hot, it has light. This is uh, the planets around the sun. Its orbit, orbits are around the sun. So, um, where we are living? If, if, if you know this, uh, we are going to see a, a video for this. But now, we have to look at where are we? This is the sun. This is the first planet, which is Mercury. Venus, this is Earth, this is our mind, this is our planet. So, this is like this. And this model is just for the Earth and the Sun, but for all the solar system. So, this is the whole of the uh, solar system. Could you please uh, lead me to read this uh, planet, if you like? Who could read these plants? Yes? Yes? Sun as, as a center of uh, solar system. Yes. First one? Mercury. Second one? Second one? Oh, sorry. Smart board. Always does this. Yes? Mars. Yes? Asteroids. Oh, this is between Mars and Jupiter. It's, it's a small uh, masses of rocks between uh, Mars and Jupiter. It's, uh, it's around the sun also, but it's, it's, it's not considered as a planet. Okay. Jupiter, Saturn, yes. Uranus, yes. Neptune, yes. Yes. So the Earth is the only planet which has a living organism on. Why do you think of this? Is there some reason for this? Or it is by chance. Okay. Because if anywhere else, like the rain is really cold there, like other places in the 
So you are going to see about uh, a suitable uh, temperature for living. Okay, another reason could you have? Food, food. You can find food on the earth. Another reason? It's the right size. Sorry? It's the right size. Side. So it's, it's, it's not, not bigger one, not smaller one, it's the middle one. Okay. Well, it has um, the right amount that it has like enough oxygen on it for humans yes. to survive. And the other plants are either too close to the sun or too far away from the sun. It's, it's not, not lighted and not suitable for temperature. It has not any air, any oxygen. Okay, would you like to add some more? It's um, other planets like Venus have too much um, volcanic volcanic activity on them, whilst we only have the odd volcano. So it's the most safe, safe, safety one. Yeah. Okay. This would you like to add? Um, well, we have an, a thick atmosphere, and some of the um, atmosphere, um, atmosphere is oxygen, nitrogen. Yeah, um, and some of the other planets only have a very thin layer of atmosphere, so it would be very cold there because the atmosphere keeps all of the in the right temperature on the air. All of your reasons is very good, all right, it's okay. But the only main reason for this is suitable temperature, atmosphere, um, light of the sun, because we are going to have some food from the Atlantis. Uh, another reason which is it's, it's suitable temperature between hot or cold, it's okay for living. So we are, we are now uh, going to um, compare between uh, this, all of these uh, planets. We know the, the, the real number of planets is nine. But since about uh, three or four years ago, scientists have deleted one of them. Which is the last one, which, which is called? Pluto. Pluto. <coughs> so what do you think? For why? So some this has cancelled or deleted this one. Okay. Um, because instead of going straight around the Earth, it goes in like nose and shape around the sun, sorry. I'm not sure about your answer, but what, what about its volume? Well, it's too small. It's too small. It's not like Earth, it's not like Jupiter, it's not like other planets. So it's, it like it to, to, to be not uh, planets, not huge, not, not biggest one. So scientists like it to, to cancel this one, and now they consider it uh, as eight, not, not nine. So you have, you have just to know this uh, this uh, tic tac, uh, and now <coughs> there's some moons around uh, uh, some of these planets, like our Earth. We have how many moons we have? Yes, one. 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 For Jupiter, it has, uh, I think, two. For Mars, it has about 18. So it's it's, uh, it's a huge numbers of moons around these planets. <coughs> now we have, we have to know the the definition of planet. What is a planet? What is a star? What about the sun? Is it biggest star or smallest star or middle star? We are going to see the whole the video now. But we have to uh, we have to mind we have to uh, refresh with our minds about this before we are going to see this video. Okay. Um, so the what is a planet? What do you think about planet? A planet is small, much smaller than a star. Yes. Even though stars up in the sky at the point look absolutely tiny, that um they could be bigger than our sun. This is about volume. What about the light? How about the temperature of the planet? Okay. Um, is it lighted or not lighted? Is it give, gives light? Gives it, light or not? It, it certainly gives us light. Okay. When the Earth is moving around, that's why we get winter, summer, spring, and autumn. Because as uh, we explain, uh, so when we're moving around, we won't be facing the sun. That's winter. Yes. But when we're right facing the sun, it's summer. So each planet couldn't give couldn't give the, the, the light, but for stars, for, for the sun, for example, it gives light. Okay. So the star, it could it, it should be different more than the planet. What about the star? If it gives light or not, it. It's,